Welcome back to Learning with Katie. I'm here at SciTech, a hands-on interactive discovery centre for kids of all ages. Are you ready to have a look around and learn some really cool things? Okay, let's go. Let's see what happens if I push this button. Can you see the bubbles of gas moving upwards through this liquid? That's happening because the gas in the bubble has a lower density than the liquid it's moving through. So it will rise all the way to the top. motion camera so we can make our very own slow motion movie let's have a go three two one <laughs> let's see how it looks <laughs> so the camera takes the video at one thousand frames per second and then plays it back to us at a much slower rate. So then it looks to us like it's in slow motion. Wow, look at this. A beehive. So this bee beehive has clear walls so we can see what the bees are doing inside the hive. Look at all those bees. It's also got a clear tube so we can see them coming in and out of the hive. So the bees will fly outside and collect nectar from plants and flowers. Then they'll come back to the hive and they'll turn it into honey. Isn't that clever? Well, this looks cool. Let me just get up on this chair, strap myself in. All right, I'll spin around. Faster, slower. Faster, slower. Did you notice that by changing my position on the chair, I could change my speed? Oh, now I'm dizzy. So we take a boat and we watch it as the current takes it downstream. Moving these plates into different slots, we can change the path of our boat or we can make it stop altogether. giant conveyor belt. All right, let's put a couple of balls on.
plastic breaking fixes Science and technology Learn about the world This is really cool. This is called a plasma sphere. So it's filled with a mixture of gases, and when we turn on the electricity to the middle, plasma is formed. Now the plasma conducts the electricity and it's attracted to our fingertips. So if we put our hands on here, it looks really cool. Science and technology. We can put these slides of bugs under here and it helps us to see tiny objects that we can't see very well with our own eyes. This is a system of tubes with air blowing through it. So let's see what happens if we put these colourful rags inside. <laughs> let's do some more. I wonder what happens when I press this button. <gasps> We've made a tornado. So spirals of moving air create a vortex. It's pretty cool. Check out these 3D printers. So how these work is they have melted plastic that goes through a nozzle that's controlled by a computer. They print one line, wait for it to dry, and then do another, and then another, and then another. It takes a long time, but you can make a plastic replica of anything you want. is to make the most stable structure that we can before the clock counts down to zero and an earthquake begins. All right, let's go. No, I don't know about this one. So 
So this tube has fast blowing air blowing right up to the top. We're gonna test out our different shapes and see which one flies the best. You ready? Did you learn a lot today at SciTech? Because I know I did. If you would like to visit SciTech, check them out online. Go to scitech.org.au for information. Thanks for joining me. See you next time on Learning with Katie. Science and technology. Test it, break it, fix it Science and technology Learn about the world Experimenting, build it, test it, break it, fix it Oh, I know The universe is so amazing Science and technology Learn about the world of it Science and technology Try If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button so you never miss a video. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Learning with Katie for even more fun and educational content. See you in our next video.